Welcome to a second example of proving two triangles are congruent. A quick review of the ways to prove triangles are congruent. We have side, 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 angle, side, angle, side, angle, and angle, angle, side. Remember, we cannot use side, side, angle, or angle, angle, angle to prove two triangles are congruent. Here we want to prove that triangle ABC is congruent to triangle ADE, given segment BC here is congruent to segment DE, and segment BC is parallel to segment DE. So these two segments here are also parallel. Let's enlarge this image and talk about our strategy before we write the proof. So again, we said that these two segments were congruent and also parallel. Well, if these two segments are parallel, then segment BD and segment CE would be transversals, and therefore we know that alternate interior angles would be congruent. So that tells us that angle E is congruent to angle C, and angle B is congruent to angle D. So very quickly we can see that we could use angle side angle to prove these two triangles are congruent. However, I also want to mention one more thing. These two angles here would be vertical angles, and therefore they would be congruent as well. Let's go ahead and mark that. So for this proof, we actually have a couple choices. We could either use angle, angle, side, or angle, side, angle, based upon how we want to construct the proof. So I think it might be helpful to show this both ways. Let's start by showing these are congruent by using angle, side, angle. Let's go ahead and state the given information. Segment BC is congruent to segment DE, and segment BC is parallel to segment DE. Let's go ahead and use the information about these two being parallel to state that the alternate interior angles would be congruent. So now we'll state that angle B is congruent to angle D, and angle C is congruent to angle E. This is by the alternate interior angles theorem. And that's really all we have to state in order to use angle side angle to prove these two triangles are congruent. So it follows that triangle, let's call it ABC, is congruent to triangle ADE. And notice how the vertices are given in corresponding order. And this was by the angle side angle postulate. Okay, let's go and take a look at the same proof, but now we'll use angle angle side to prove these two triangles are congruent. Let's start off by labeling what we already know. These two sides are congruent and parallel. So we'll go ahead and state the given information again. Now let's go ahead and state that these vertical angles are congruent. So angle BAC is congruent to angle DAE. And the reason is that vertical angles are congruent Let's go ahead and mark that. So we have this angle is congruent to this angle. And then we have a choice if we want to state that angle E is congruent to angle C, or if angle D is congruent to angle B. It doesn't really matter because in both cases we'll have angle, angle, side. Let's go ahead and use angle D and B. So angle B is congruent to angle D. This is by the alternate interior angles theorem. And now we can state the two triangles are congruent. Triangle ABC is congruent to triangle ADE. But this time the reason is angle, angle, side postulate. So there's often more than one way to construct a geometric proof. So just because your answer may not match the back of the book doesn't mean that it's incorrect. 
I hope you found this helpful.